This video shows you how to give users access to ClickSense without supplying a user identity or credentials. You can do this by editing the virtual proxy in the QMC. On the QMC start page, select Virtual Proxies, then select the virtual proxy that handles the authentication and click Edit. In the Anonymous Access Mode drop-down list, select Allow Anonymous User. This lets a user enter as anonymous and then switch to a user account. Or you can select Always Anonymous User if all users are always anonymous. In this case, we select the first option. Click Apply to save your changes, then click OK. Now, you need to create a login access rule that allows anonymous user authentication. Go back to the QMC Start page and click License Management. Click Login Access Rules and click Create New. Type in a name and the number of tokens you want to allocate. When done, click Apply. Then, in the Properties tab, select Advanced. In the Conditions text field, insert user.isanonymous followed by open and closed parentheses. Anonymous use of ClickSense is now allowed. You can test this by logging out of ClickSense and opening the hub. As you can see, you can open the sheets and interact with the data contained in the app. And that concludes this video. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to receive new content every week.